constraint box is a widget which imposes additional constraints on its child widget. Let's see an example for this. We have a stateless widget here where there is a container with 100 pixels height and blue background. Now I want to add some constraints or limitations to the width of the container. So I can wrap container with constraint box. It takes in constraints and child. This constraint property is of the type box constraints due to which we can specify maximum and minimum height and width. This is what separates sized box and container from con constraint box. Now I can increase the height of the container so let me say 200 and you can see the change happening. Now I will add a maximum width of 800 to our container but before saving let me see what happens when I resize the browser. The container takes in all the available width doesn't it? But now after saving if I resize the browser you can see that the container takes a maximum of 800 pixels of width on the entire screen. If it doesn't get at least 800 pixels, it takes all the width after which it takes only 800 pixels. This was all about Constraint Box. See you in the next video.